U.S. First Lady Melania Trump on Tuesday violated the stated mask policy at Children's National Hospital as she removed her mask to read a holiday book to children. According to a report, the First Lady arrived in the hospital's main atrium wearing a mask but when she took her seat in front of a tree, she removed the mask. According to the hospital policy, Everyone must wear a mask at all times while in any children's national facility to prevent the spread of COVID-19, including wearing a mask when entering any children's national building, as mandated by area officials. This includes all public places, such as the hallway and cafeteria and wearing a mask at all times when you are around other individuals. The report also suggests that the First Lady did not comment on why she removed her mask and if she had received special permission to do so. Diana Trees, Children's National Spokeswoman, citing the Washington, D.C., health regulators, said, Our number one priority at Children's National Hospital is the safety of our patients, families and employees. Under D.C. health regulations, Wearing a mask is not required when a person is giving a speech for broadcast or an audience, provided no one is within six feet of the speaker. The First Lady was diagnosed with COVID-19 at the same time as President Donald Trump in early October. But health experts say it's still unclear how long antibodies offer protection and recommend still wearing a mask. News Desk